continuation of day one of our Harmony of the Seas vlog series. You can watch all of the other Harmony videos by clicking the link in the description below. Dinner was 10 out of 10. Amazing. It was a great vibe. Superb. Great start to the trip. We're hyped. And our servers are really cool, so. They were awesome. We really liked them. We're gonna take the elevator up to... Is that an empty <gasps> elevator? An empty glass elevator. That's like dreams come true. We're going 17? <laughs> uh, 17. We're gonna go up to the Diamond Lounge on 17. Look at this. Look how trippy this is. Casey made a good point that in the dining room, the, the art display looked like a bunch of pencils. We'll have to show you guys. Ooh. An empty elevator. It's like reverse Tower of Terror. Reverse Tower of Terror. 17. We don't really know where the Diamond Lounge is. Sweet There's a Sweet Lounge. lounge. Definitely, I know. Is there one? I would Google it, but you know what that's like. It said it on our piece of paper. Technically, it said that Catherine <laughs> and Steve had access to the Diamond Lounge because they gave us the wrong papers, but we're also Diamond. So we're looking at this map trying to figure out. Oh, Diamond Club. Ooh, four. It's in the casino. There's a whole non-smoking casino. Yeah. Sign me up. We'll have to check that out. Okay, so order of operations, we'll check that out later. Next up, I think we said that we wanted to go over to, since we're all the way at the top, <laughs> the tippy tippy top, is there something else we should check out first? What do you guys want to see? Let us know. It's... Puzzle break center? Sign me up. I like puzzles. <laughs> what about the flow rider at night? Whatever we you go want. see if anyone's flow riding. <laughs> flow riding. Apple bottom jeans. Boops. What do you want to do? You want to? Let's go to the flow rider because we're up here. Okay. And you can see the pool deck at night. Yeah. Because it's pretty. Is there a way out here? Or we just gotta take stairs first. Oh. I don't know. Magic. Open sesame. Oh, I that breeze magic. in me. Can we see any other cruise ships? Not right now. We're out on the pool deck and this breeze. Superb, impeccable. I'm gonna need a new word. Can you even hear me? I'm gonna need a new word besides impeccable. The more you talk about the breeze, the more breezier the breeze gets. <laughs> it's like, oh, you like the breeze? I'm gonna breeze it up even more. I don't even know if you can hear us. Oh, the hot tubs are open. Look yeah. how nice this looks. I'm pretty sure that they close at 10, most of the hot tubs. I'm not positive on that, but I mean, look, there's like a hot tub over there. It's empty. What time is it now? 9.25. 9.25. You know, it's weird. I'm in airplane mode and I'm getting emails, so. Like we're not paying for Wi-Fi right now, but the wind, I'm eating my hair. We're not paying for Wi-Fi right now, but like we're getting notifications. We just can't do anything about it. So it's kind of torture because it's like work emailing. <laughs> It's like, we can't respond. Sorry. It's like urgent. I need a response in 12 minutes. I'm like, I can't. It's like, sorry, bud. I'll answer in seven days. Look how amazing Central Park looks right now. The ship is beautiful. She's a beaut, clerk. That's what I'm saying. I don't know where our room is. I've not really thought too hard about that, but all I know is it's somewhere over here. I think, didn't you say we can see the 150 Central Park from our balcony? Oh yeah, we're right over there. So I think we're right here. Yeah, that's true, we're over there. It's so pretty. Look at this, there's, there's some good vibes going on here. The vibes, this ship is vibey right now. And you know what, this is what, this is what I was waiting for, because we got on the ship and it was like, honestly overwhelming, madness, mayhem. And I'm like, oh God, this is gonna be crazy. Cause this is obviously the biggest ship I've been on, the most people. And uh, I will say, once everyone disperses, once you sail off, like it really kind of comes into a comfortable setting where it's not overwhelming, so. It's beautiful. And if you don't know, this is Matt's first Oasis class ship. He's only ever been on two cruises. He's been on the Disney Wish, which in was- In February. In February of, this, of 2023. Freedom of the Seas. Yep. And those were his only cruises he's ever been on. So yeah. he's only really done the small ones. He's yeah. never done an Oasis class. It's, it's so. Big, big difference for sure. This is a big boy. Oh, look, ship. One, yeah. two, three. Three ships, I don't know. You're not gonna be able to see that, but there's three ships out there. There's not too many people on the pool, but it's still open and kicking. 
thinking of tomorrow when everyone's at Coco K of utilizing the, uh, the slides over here. They open up at 9.30 in the morning and they'll be open throughout until later in the day. So low crowds might have to capitalize on that. He's never seen anything like this before. So super exciting, even exciting for me. And I've been on the ship before. This is my third time on the Harmony. Subtle Second, flex. third. But to be fair, I've been cruising for years. So like it's over the span of a few years. Yeah. Not like this year. Oh, the vibes. Look at the vibes in this hot tub. Oh, the hot tub's open. Look at the like star lights. The starlights, vibey. Sports wow. on TV, vibey. We gotta do this at one point. 10 out of 10. That's that's gonna be the move. Nine, we had dinner, we come out here. Should we do that tomorrow? <clears throat> Sold. I think that's a good idea. Sign me up. I'll be right there tomorrow night, 9 p.m. Be there or be somewhere else. Square. Circle. That's a very circular square. I'm doing the best I can. Goodbye. You know? <laughs> <laughs> the solarium at night, wonderful. Superb, spectacular. And the soundtrack is, I feel like I'm at Disney World. Like <laughs> going on Space Mountain. It's so zen in here. Calm. Is that a kid zone over there? Yeah. It's a weird place to put them. <laughs> we're gonna go back out to the deck where we were earlier, where you can like walk out. The vibes. A quarter of vibe. If you go over here, see that down there? That's the ocean. That's scary. Like if I step here, oh, I don't like that. Don't fall. I'm standing on the ocean. Well, now I'm I am. Oh, edge. I don't like that. <laughs> of harmony. No? Okay. <laughs> I like when you sing it. I'm on the edge of harmony. Look at that, the stairs. I want these lights in my stairs. This is so relaxing. Yeah. I could sit here all night. I wonder if you're allowed to sleep out here. It doesn't say you can't, question mark. We just came into the spa to look at the price list. Here's an idea of the services that they offer and the prices. It's pretty pricey, but a lot of times at port days, they'll have discounts on massages and other services. So come during a port day if you would like a massage because it's cheaper. They have a mini Starbucks. It's not a Starbucks. It's Vitality Cafe and they have juices and coffees. Oh, they do sell Starbucks. Yeah, you got the Starbucks cups and everything. Huh. Or you could go to the real Starbucks downstairs. That's a good point. <laughs> but they have a nail salon. They do hair. You can get a blowout. You can get a massage. You can get all sorts of treatments. You can get Botox. Please. I would love to get Botox. <laughs> An elevator has arrived. Another empty elevator. We're getting lucky. Where are we going? Six. Six. Another empty elevator! It really boom. doesn't happen often, boom, but we're getting boom, lucky. Boom, 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 boom. My hair is fluffy. There once was a man on the harmony. No, we're not rapping. We're done. Ready? There once was a man on the harmony. Okay, that was rude. <laughs> Interrupting a rap. Whoa, it's popping out here. It's lively. Lively. Oh, the head is spinning. Remember earlier we were oh, wondering? Yeah. It's actually spinning, like, at a high rate of speed. That's, that's spinning fast. That's pretty cool. I heard you talking about him. He's like, yo. If he stops and looks at me right now and just stops That facing. would be weird. I wonder, does it only spin a little bit and then stop? And then it spins again later. I don't know, but this is cool. There's a shore excursion kiosk down here in the promenade, and you can scan your ID card and look at all the different excursions that they offer. We want to see... Uh, rhino rider? Oh, it's a boat. I was like, wait, can you ride a rhino? It's a little too exciting. <laughs> it sounded cool. If I could ride, if I could ride a rhino, let me just be honest with you, I'd be booking that right now. That's what I'm saying. We need to find, I think it's called Mahi Beach. But basically that's the, oh, here you go, Maho Beach. 
So, yeah, experience the thrill of watching, hearing, and feeling a commercial airplane as it lands merely feet above you while... Oh, no, it just stops. It's <laughs> uh, the whole thing. Wow, this is a, a whole ordeal. It's literally four and a half hour long plane spotting. Oh, that's the entire day that we're there. Yeah, we could go check it out ourselves. Wait. Can you drive your own Jeep? Rev up your adrenaline with a thrilling Jeep tour. Due to shared vehicles, guests are not guaranteed the opportunity to drive. Oh, okay. Perfect day. Oh, okay. How much are jet skis? Sold out? Yeah, there's none. I did the Swimming with Pigs tour with my family and it was so cute. I'll put pictures in here. But basically you just get in the ocean and there's a bunch of pigs. <laughs> Pretty cool. You know, you, cool. you got to swim with them. Now you're dating one. We do not have any excursions booked for this cruise. Maybe next cruise, maybe. I really want to do jet skis on Coco Cay. Snorkeling with sea turtles? It's a problem, right? We're not going to ever save money when I point out <laughs> excursions like this one. How much is snorkeling with sea turtles? That's not bad. $125 to see a sea turtle. I'll Google a picture of one and show you what they look like. That's well, not the same. Look at that though, there's a turtle. I love sea turtles. Look at that, that could be me. This one's different, $104. Sold. Scuba diving equipment, you need your own wetsuit. <laughs> yeah, I brought that. Good thing I keep it in my uh, emergency wetsuit container. I definitely forgot my wetsuit. Ooh, 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 I'm falling. Honeymoon beach cycle party. Sky ride. Turtles! More turtles! Wait, what's this turtle one? $89. Cheaper, okay. You have to go on a catamaran. There's a lot of cool excursions though. Yeah, it's nice So I didn't see this on the Freedom. An option is tap your card, explore the available excursions. Show them how it works, tap your card. Just boop. Boop. All right, there you go. So easy. So easy. You just say, hey, you know what? What do we got going on? <laughs> okay. So well, easy. Watch it this. worked seamlessly the first time we walked up. It really did. The first time we came <laughs> here, it was like... He just walked up, scanned it, and walked away. Anyway, if you want to book an excursion, there's this whole excursion desk. There's a crew member here during the day that can help you. So if you want to book a short excursion, you can either do it right on the iPad or in your Royal Caribbean app, or you can talk to the person. Or, you know what? Make the excursion yourself. You want to swim with sea turtles? Jump in the water. Find a sea turtle. You want to drive a Jeep? Steal a Jeep. Neither of those are recommended advice. Just know that life is an excursion. It's a free what, one. A free one. <laughs> Slight okay. consequences if you do some of the things I recommend. Okay. <laughs> I'm so excited for the balloon drop tonight. They got some shopping going on in the middle of the promenade. Do you want a cover up for $4.49? Uh, I think the blue would look great on I you. would if I didn't already have this in pink. Oh, true, I forgot you just bought that. I can only have one of each. <laughs> bon voyage. They have a lot of sales that go on. They bring out these, they bring out a bunch of the merchandise that's just generic. It's not usually Royal Caribbean stuff. Listen, I know it's the first day, but should we go to next cruise and go book our next cruise? The good thing is we have three, four upcoming cruises, so I don't think we need to. It's so close though. We could walk in there right now and just book a new one. Shut up, shut up, what up? There's a booth for the Focus Photo Gallery and they're selling SD pocket. cards, the pocket, GoPros. If you forget your GoPro, they have little Instax cameras, Polaroids. I was saying to Casey that they need to sell disposable cameras and I guess this is what they They listen. Went with. I they like saw go, you. You know, growing up, you go to CVS, you pick up a uh, disposable camera, you just waste all 25 shots in the first 12 seconds. <laughs> and your mom's like, what are you? Okay, you know? <laughs> oh, look at the bars up. This is the rising tide bar, but right now it's risen. And then it'll come back down. The next departure is at 10 15 p.m. Oh, so you go and you're. You're committing. Oh yeah, it's like a 30 minute thing, but this is in the promenade and then it goes up and lets you off in Central Park. So you can get off 30 minutes in and then it goes really slow back down. Wow. But it's a whole bar. Not we'll show sure you later. Me. We'll go on it later. Yeah, we love alcohol. We, we like don't. Diet Coke. I want 
to try Diet Coke from every bar, you know, mix it up. Sometimes the bottles just hit different. There's a bionic bar over there and all of the alcohol bottles are on top. There are actual robot arms that'll make your drink after you order on an iPad, like it pulls alcohol from the bottles hung on the ceiling and then it mixes a drink for you right in front of you. Super cool, but there's a lot of people there right now. So we'll show you that tomorrow when it's less busy so that you can see it all. We walked up one deck from the promenade. Now we're on the boardwalk. Here's the we're gonna go check out one of the shops. Look at the carousel's open now. I'm jealous. Here's a store we could go in. This is the design district store. Oh, this is like fancy clothes, not Royal Caribbean. We just walked through the casino. And behind Studio B, there's the Diamond Club. And look how fancy this looks. Also, this is super trippy. <laughs> to cool. do is to be. To be is to do. Dooby dooby do. That's how I feel. If you're ever wondering what's going on inside my head, it's that. Good. Oh, Sinatra. Yeah, <laughs> Aristotle. Let's go in the Diamond Club because we are we? Crown and Anchor Diamond members. every time. The this artwork is. on this ship is interesting. Oh. So, fun fact, they have an entire non-smoking <laughs> casino here. What? He's just sit posing. He was waving. <laughs> There's a whole non-smoking casino. That's awesome. Normally for non-smoking sections, like there's just a section in the normal casino, but here it's a whole separate casino. Yeah, and it I doesn't do that. much in the actual casino. Like you're still standing very close to where they're smoking. Yeah, so that's nice. It's literally on the other side of the ship on the same deck. I like it. Greece. We'll be seeing Greece tomorrow, which she is very excited about. I'm not like a huge theater person. Like Broadway, play, uh, I'm so I'm sorry, don't come for me. The thing is, we're on the ship. It's something to do, it's supposed to be spectacular. So, let's do it. Well, let's do it. We're gonna go up to floor six to the boardwalk and deck go see six. the aqua show. Um, it's not a floor, this is a cruise ship, so we call it deck. It's funny, because we did that like after the freedom. Hi. <laughs> after the freedom that we went on. Um, I kept calling everything a deck. Like we went to a hotel after and I kept calling it decks and Matt was like, it's a floor, we're at a hotel. And now we're on a cruise and I'm so used to saying floor and it's a deck. Yeah, she's like, can you get my water bottle from deck two? I'm like, it's upstairs of our house. It's not a deck. <laughs> deck two. <laughs> uh, but we're on four right now. We're gonna go up to six and go back to the boardwalk and see if we can get a walk up for the aqua show. We're seeing it on night three anyway. Is it empty? Another empty one. <gasps> We're seeing it on night three anyway, but we're gonna see if they walk up because it's a super cool show, so I don't mind seeing it twice. Yeah, it uh, starts in four minutes, so. Let's go try, it's worth a try. Life is worth a try. Look at this, another empty elevator. Fun fact, on deck six, you cannot get across. <laughs> so on one side of deck six is the spa and the other side of deck six is the boardwalk, but you cannot walk across, like it doesn't connect. So we're walking down to five to walk across to go back up to six. Yeah, that's a good time to find out. But luckily, who cares? Even if we see it from afar, briefly, just kill some time. Yeah, and we'll see it on day three as well. Ooh. So. They're vibing over here. All right. I'm digging it. At 12 o'clock exactly, they're gonna release all these balloons. It's funny because at 12 o'clock, they have the balloon drop, and then at 12.05 on the schedule is balloon drop cleanup. This is the rising tide bar that we were talking about. Remember when it like wasn't here five minutes ago? Well, it's made its way back down. And they're gonna take it up to Central Park. And you can stay on and ride it up and down all day if you want. Pretty cool. Oh my god, my dad would love it.
as you saw, we tried to go to the Aqua Show. So if you're doing it as a walk up, make sure you arrive super early because there were no seats left. Yeah, it said be there at least 10 minutes before the show starts if you want to be a walk up. We were not, but we saw enough. Yeah, you could see enough from the back. You just can't sit up close or get a seat at all. You will be standing the whole time. Another empty elevator. Boom. It smells boom, like boom, cigarettes. Boom, boom. It does. Either get that early or... or just be smart and reserve it on the app like we did. Yeah, you can do that even before you board. A few days before you board. Yeah. We're gonna go back to our room. It's like, what, 10.30 right now? 10.30, yeah. Unpack a little bit, because we still haven't done that. And then at 12 o'clock, we're gonna go down to the balloon drop. So we got some time to kill and to try to not fall asleep. Yeah, I, we're running quite literally on empty, so. Our location for our room has been awesome. It's basically right in the middle of everything. And it's nice. I like it. I'm digging it. Yeah. Yeah. Well, she said. Yeah. Hell yeah. 239. The artwork on this ship is super bizarre. Super bizarre. Some of it's super cool. Like, look at this. Just wing it. Just wing it. Life, Life eyeliner, everything. I feel like that doesn't appeal to me, the entire audience, <laughs> or Matt. <laughs> so I'm confused. Welcome home. Thanks. We are in yet another empty elevator, heading down to the promenade to go to the balloon drop. There's a balloon celebration party right now, so there's like, there's live music going on. There's a lot of fun stuff going on in uh, the promenade. That's fine. There's a lot of people. We're exhausted. We're trying to get to the balloons. Honestly, we were not even gonna go to that balloon drop because we're running on empty, but I'm happy we did. That was cool, that was really cute. That was cool, got some cool footage. Tomorrow we're gonna be at Coco Cay, so make sure you stay tuned for all of our vlog adventures. We have seven nights on this cruise, so it's gonna be a fun series. So we'll see you in the next one, we hope you enjoyed, and bye. If you wanna watch the rest of this video or the other Harmony of the Seas videos, make sure to check out my channel in the link below. Bye.